Hello. I am, against my better judgment, going to try and play Zoro. I got some done, I think it was Friday, something like that. Thursday or Friday? No, it was yesterday. I forget when I tried it. Uh, I got past a couple levels, but I'm just going to start from scratch because I don't really remember how to play it. So, um, And I also got my course set up. So I've got Game Boy, Game Boy Advance, Color, Game Gear, PC Engine, Pokemon Mini, SNES, Super Game Boy, and Wonderswan. Uh, I don't have anything on PC Engine, um, and I haven't added anything for the Pokemon Mini. I have to search for those. Um, but I stuck on some SNES cores just just to see, you know, how well it would run, and runs pretty well actually. I was pretty surprised. And it sounds pretty good. I just want to try it real fast. I haven't tried X yet on this. It looks a little squashed. But other than that, it looks and feels pretty good. And I didn't get a pocket just so I could play, you know, SNES games, but it's still a pretty cool feature. So. I tested out uh, Mario Kart, and it ran pretty well. I was going to play, I kind of want to go through, I've got this this box just filled with Game Boy games, and I kind of wanted to play um, Kid Icarus and go through that. I haven't played that in a long time, probably about 10 years or so. Um, but I want to give this a go first. And I went through and like organized all the folders and shit. Also, the only thing though, if it's if the the game name is too long, it kind of cuts it off a little bit, or maybe it doesn't. Oh no, it doesn't. Okay, I see what it's doing. Anyways, where are we at here? Maybe it's just under Z. No. Uh, M, sorry. There it is. The only thing I will say about the... the, um... The cores is you don't have access to any of the, I guess, it probably doesn't really matter, but you don't get access to any display options like you would if you were playing on the cartridge through the pocket itself. I'm going to turn this down just a little bit. Sounds like it's a little ear piercing, but hopefully. I don't even know if I took a screenshot of the password or not. Actually, I want to read the manual first. <laughs> Tip. 
A little long haired Anthony Hopkins. It's like, okay, how to play. They're, it's written like it's trying to sell it to you. Guide the old and new Zorro as they defied Montero and attempt to defeat his scheme to take control of California. Leap over high balconies. Race across treacherous rooftops. Climb on it. Just... Okay. <laughs> At key points in your quest, you will receive passwords from Don Diego. Password. Control pad up, move up, climb ropes, enter doors, talk to other characters, fire the cannon. <laughs> okay. Down, move down or crouch, combine with left or right control pad and to roll in that direction. A is to use the sword, B button is to jump, hold button to bounce higher or to grab and swing around the pole. Okay. So you do have to hold on to B, which is what I figured out when I first started playing. To use sword, hold button to stay in fencing mode. Okay. So you hold A and you're in fencing mode. So we get a block, high, low. Back buttons are all blocks. And then attack high, attack forward, and attack low. Okay, note these controls are reversed as they were facing left. Yeah, I kind of figured that. And then it's going over enemies. <laughs> there are many paths that lead to trouble. There are a few paths that lead to victory. Basically, all it's saying is just poke the enemy to death and you win. Okay. Seems like I can avoid these guys to begin with if I go this way, though. Whoop. Oh, is that not a ledge I can sit on? Oops. They just, I don't get that, they just die instantly. Maybe it's, um... Zoro. 
What do we do? Shaking out of boots. Bond. Shrink, shrink, shrink. Zero fuel. Oh crap. No, well, actually, you just go in. <laughs> you just bypass them completely. Welcome. Okay, so there's a wall there, so I wouldn't have been able to get over there. Can I go in here? Sir, I love that sword. It's a very nice, expensive looking golden sword. But silver trumps gold. <laughs> Die. And it just disintegrates, but his health bar is still there. Oops. T Looks like health is kind of plenty through here. Whoops. Oh. I didn't like it. Oh, okay. I was seeing that, that... I thought that was a platform worm right underneath it. I thought that was part of the platform, but I guess not. Why are these guys here? <laughs> Why are you here, Stab? It doesn't even look like a... It's not even a door. I know I don't need to kill him, but... <laughs> oh yeah, that's right, I can roll. I forgot about that. Changes at all. I would murder a hundred innocent men if it meant killing you. When the pupil is ready, the master will appear. Well, that, that was a. This is called the training. That was a tragic end to whatever was going on there. I've never even seen the movie, so I have no idea what happens. <laughs> Whoop, whoop. Oh, we got them in there. Okay, I bypassed that trap. <laughs> or maybe I didn't. No, I did. It was a different area. This is that overhand attack. There we go. Was that the same password? No, it's different. Okay, that's weird though. Ooh. Oh, that was a wall. Okay. So my Oh yeah, and then I caused them both to fight? I don't know, I get it. Okay, I remember getting past this part. Wait, is this... Can I go over to the right? Or, oh, okay, never mind. I have to go over to the left. Maybe? Yep. Secret. Okay. 
Okay, so where I'm going. Can I just jump over you? No. That's right. Got to roll in her here. And just completely skip these guys. <laughs> Somehow they have wall hacks and they're able to get through. Oh, that's right. This is where I was trying to figure out what to do. I can just... Whoops. No, no, no. And then there's just this... Shelf with the couch for some reason. <laughs> Which I completely botched. Wasn't this the wall I was supposed to... No? Where's this? Oh, that's right. I can just completely bypass that whole jumping pole thing. Is this the... Ah, oh, shit. A little confused, but yeah, that's okay. We'll, we'll figure it out. <laughs> no, 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 stop. No. He's gonna kill me. Yep. Excuse me, sirs. Oh, they're each taking turns, like, stabbing at me, I guess? But they all died at once. No, 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 no. Okay. I keep holding down B, thinking I'm like, this is gonna make me jump a little higher, but it does not. Okay, so I, I am forced to go that way then. Oh, maybe it's like they start backing up like this because I started attacking them first and they're on the defensive. Maybe that's how it works. Like, if they're not ready for me, I can just start attacking them. Oops. Let's see if I can grab this. No? Where am I supposed to grab it? <laughs> Underhand swipe. Hello? <laughs> Sir? Like, can you die now, please? Oh, whoa. Okay. I didn't know there was a door. Hey, I did it. Wait, wait, I'm confused. I think I had this problem last time. So... Excuse me. 
Okay, how's he, how come he's not grabbing it? There we go. That was weird. I wonder if I can skip them by swinging up. Whoop! No. <laughs> that I'm probably gonna fall. <laughs> okay, is that... Is there a door here? This doesn't look like a ledge I can walk on. Fuck. Okay, phew. <laughs> Concerned, I thought... I didn't think that was something I could walk on. I'm gonna take that password. <laughs> Ugh, man, I got a, some weird sinus pressure going on here. <laughs> Cutscene, don't care. Anytime you want to die, please. Okay, I couldn't damage him at all. Does he keep dropping the sword on his foot or something? No. Oops. Yeah, I can see how this would be a little difficult here. I mean, just, just trying to get on this platform alone is, is pretty hard. There's nothing up here. Oh, I thought I was going to get stuck in there. <laughs> we'll put this pile of trash here. Okay, there's two ropes. way first. Oh, alright. Thanks. So, yeah, that's just health. Okay. Was, hang on, I want to see, does anything give you extra lives? I 
Because I, I saw the heart, so I just skimmed right over it. Single heart, this will add Zoro to be hit one additional time by filling up one slice of the health bar. Oh, so you can get a bigger health bar, maybe? The triple heart will allow Zoro to be hit three additional times by filling up three slices of the health bar. Oh, okay, never mind. Piece of heart, this will completely refill the health bar, and kiss the girl, this will completely refill Zoro's, okay. Zoro's health bar. It doesn't say anything about lives or continues or anything like that. Uh, okay, no, this was just that small area. Okay. Why does he have his dukes up? Why is he punching? What? That is weird, okay. Was it because that enemy was showing? Hey, it's Jaws. <laughs> You're in the wrong movie. You're supposed to be in that not very good Bond film. Apparently he's trying to defeat me with his flexing. Just flex it off! Uh, my flexes were not strong enough. <laughs> Is this what they were talking about, the cannon? Oh, yep. Wow, I'm glad I read that. How the fuck would you have known that? I would have gotten here and been like, where am I supposed to go? Oh, they kind of lock you in this area. Okay, never mind. Oh, is this the church I heard about? Excuse me, sir, we're not supposed to be fencing in, in the holy... the holy building. <laughs> okay, I guess I can go in the confessional. <laughs> It's bigger on the inside. Oh god, he respond. Blood on the pews. <laughs> and they all died. Oh shit. Oh shit. Uh. Uh, why am I back here? Oh, because it's not a new area. Go back to the start of this shit? Bro, stop. I can't even guard. That's bullshit. Fuck that guy. I have to go all the way back? That sucks. Well, at least the um, the hearts are, you know, respawn as well. I can't even tell like what's going on when you're fighting. It's so weird. I'm gonna die. I'm just gonna skip him. <laughs> so, do I have to do this whole thing again? Or is this the girl right here? Yeah, she's gone. Well, I'm gonna die. Oh, great. That's disappointing. Oh, okay. Well, what the fuck? How come I started back here? But when I died in the church, I started from the whole area again. Well, that's gone too. Is the flexing guy down here again? Yep. Just 
poke him, poke him in the dick. Stab. It's not working. He's got balls of steel. Uh. Okay. So here's. Yeah, I'm gonna just go ahead and get that heart again. No, that's gone. Okay. Oh, I can. <laughs> you just jump over and fuck you. Okay, so that, that musket guy was here, but he wouldn't let me shoot him. So, or I, he wouldn't let me kill him. So I guess I can't attack him when he's getting ready to shoot me. Unless maybe I use like a, a lower swing. There's another one. Is he trying to shoot me again? Can you shoot me from up there? I don't think he's trying to. <laughs> can I get up here? Whoops. It's so hard. Oh wait, yeah, I can, duh. Climb the rope. Okay, so... Alright, I guess not. Oh, shit! I didn't forget who he was. <laughs> okay, cool. Alright, so I started back here again. I was worried it was going to throw me back to where it did last time. Oops. Can I jump up here? like almost I can do it I can do it Arrgh, button mash button mash no I can't do it oh well darn it you shot me in the foot why is it sending me back where am I uh where am I I'm on the right hand. I'm on the right. I can see my sword poking on the right hand side. Oh, what the fuck? That was weird. Oops. Darn it. Can I not do this anymore? There we go. See you. Actually, when I went in last time, that's where it threw me back. So maybe it uses that as a checkpoint or something. There's nothing in here. <laughs> it's like he hits me once and then uses that to flex on me and then but then I get him in a loop or something. I'm just gonna get that heart. Oh, that's right, it's not there. But I can jump over him, that's right. What? Shit. 
Shit. Okay. I wonder if there's a point to coming over here. Okay. The reason why I'm going back in and out because it seems to kind of count as like a checkpoint. Wait, can I jump over here? Did I just skip this area? Oh, he's got a pistol. I'm gonna go in here and see if there's... Okay. Just gonna skip you and go in here. Wait, so that just leads to oh wait, okay, that just leads to him. Ow. <laughs> I guess I stunlocked him because he's got Looks like he's getting ready to attack, but then I guess I hit him. I'll take it. Oh, and then he disintegrates. Is I supposed to go that way? Oh, okay. It's the same place each time. So what is this place? Is this like... Whoa. Is this like your hideout or something? Okay. It's not letting me get past him. I guess I'll go this way. <laughs> Alright. Looks like I found five secrets so far. Oh shit. Ooh. Can I can I kill this guy? Alright, well I'm just gonna run past him. Fuck him. So I can go over to the left again. Is this another like, this looks like the last area I went through. I can't go in there. Oh. Right. Yeah, it's just literally a repeat of the one of the last, the, the previous areas I was just in. Shit, shit, get in. Oh, fuck. I, I don't agree, game. Okay, so once he's done shooting, then I can run past him.
I'm guessing I can't, like, duck when he shoots. Why does he drop? I'm gonna shoot. Okay. Oh, what? Whoa. Almost looked like it was gonna fall through the floor for a second. Can I swing up here? I didn't even think I could grab onto that. I just happened to jump and, and grab onto it. What's the point of that? <laughs> attack the knee, attack the knee, attack the knee. Urgh, my knees. Maybe I can... Yeah, okay. Whee! Is that a musket guy? No, okay. Fall to your death. Fall to your death! Come on. Thank you. Oh, shit. Okay, so you can grab onto all of them. That's interesting. Oh, oh, shit! <laughs> what? That's such BS. Why would it send me all the way back to the beginning? I wonder if I can jump over one of this. Can I even grab this one? Huh. I guess not. I wonder why I can't do it on this level. Is it is it the next level only that I can grab onto the chandeliers? At least it's not too hard to get back. But still, that's kind of bullshit that it would send me all the way back there. Okay, stop rolling. Thank you. Come on. Kneecaps again? Okay. Going for your kneecaps. Shoot. Yeah, I'm not going to make a, a jump. I'm just going to try and vault over there. It feels safer, I guess. And maybe that's the only way you're supposed to get over there. Okay. Just got to remember that rifleman's up there. Kneecaps. Uh, I'm gonna die. Shoot. Okay. That's better. At least it didn't send me that same beginning of the level. Stop rolling. <laughs> I don't know if that's the game or if it's my controller or the D-pad. 
The knees. Go for the knees. Okay, no, that's just the game. Because I was holding down and then forward, and you just keep rolling until you let go of it. So. Oh, wait, actually. Okay, I didn't want to do that, but <laughs> that works anyways. I wonder if it treats some of these doors like checkpoints. Okay, why can't I... Why couldn't I grab the chandeliers that time? Kneecaps. There we go. Had me worried for a little bit that I was bugged out or something. Ouch. Oops. Crap, I thought I had gotten him and then let go of the fence button. <laughs> okay, that was dumb. Okay, stop jumping. Okay, Rifleman is... there. <laughs> and there. <laughs> Secret. Yay, some health. Okay, now I gotta figure out where to go. I'm gonna go in here first. Because maybe it'll. Oh, okay. Jerk. Yeah, that's right, you walk through that wall. Ooh, I wonder if I can. No? Okay. I was gonna say, well, maybe I can. Oh, shit. <laughs> Alright, well, at least it kept me here. Ooh, damn. That's really disappointing. Can I kill these guys? That's really disappointing. And that's why I kept walking in and out of that door, because it seems like it acts as a temporary checkpoint. from up here, he fires, misses, and he can't do anything else, so let's go on to the next area. Okay, now let go, okay. <laughs> yes, I need to, my, my man has, has been taken. I need to reclaim it. Dude, this this game sucks. <laughs> I mean it's not it's not bad bad, but it's just to the point where it's it's so broken that it's it can be pretty aggravating if you uh if you're not prepared for it, I guess. I don't know. Because, like, right here, I'm supposed to be able to grab on the chandelier, but I can't. There we go. But it's like, I'll get I'll get killed. Like, if I go into, like, one of those rooms and then come back out and get killed, I'll be sent back to that first door. But if I don't go into one of those small rooms and get killed, I get sent all the way back to the first beginning of the level. Oops, oops, oops. And it's just kind of... And I'm assuming with these, with each enemy, there's different strategies to each. Like, the next guy that comes up, all he'll do is just, like, a single slow th uh, sword stab. Okay, that sucks.
but I can hit him in between, I still get hit. See, if I hadn't gone in there and gotten killed, uh, I would have been since the beginning of level, but because I went back in and out, if it still acts as a temporary checkpoint, it's kind of weird. Ugh. See, it'll put me in front of that door. Oh, no? Okay. See how, see how broken this is? Because I'm back at the end of the previous area, and I'm on the right-hand side. And you can see... You can see my sword poking out of the right-hand side. And it looks like I'm stuck, but I can jump from the right. <laughs> it's... that's... yeah. So it, it's not that... Yeah. So it's not that it's difficult, it's just that it's so broken that it just gives us this art artificial difficulty. And it's just really hard to manage. Oh, there was a secret there. I didn't mean to do that. I just happened to head up. But I'll take it. I got a feeling though that a, a camel and Fexy are probably going to be kind of pissed at me because they kept, I know they kept mentioning something about a church. Like, I wonder if what's his name has gotten past the church part. Um, so I'm wondering if that's like a really notorious area because I, I did kind of run into something um, where I couldn't grab onto one of the, um, the pole vaults. But I went to the right, and it looked like I kind of, like, walked through a wall I wasn't supposed to. So I think I might have cheesed it. I'm not sure. But, I mean, I'll take it. Oh, there was a secret entrance there. Okay. Cool. I'll take that. Is it that... There was, like, that's the only area that has this weird little shadow to it, so I'm like, oh, I wonder if this is a, a secret... And these rifle guys, like, kill you in one hit, which kind of sucks. You have to, like, jump over them before they fire. Um, I think I can get over here. Okay. No, 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 no. Oh, no. Okay. See, he still... Sh you have to do it, like, perfectly, because... Cause he'll still shoot you in the foot if you're if he hits your hitbox. Crap. I can't jump up. There we go. This is so janky. Okay. Zoro as Bender from Futurama. <laughs> what, what? Hang on, I'll have to see it. Oh, I see it, yeah. <laughs> kind of, yeah. Oh, ooh, I thought I was going to miss that. It looks like I'm at the pole vault here, but I'm going to... Okay, never mind. Ooh, shit. That's not good. Hopefully I can just kill him so he doesn't... Re I don't think he responds unless I go through a door. If that's the case, I'm going to try and... There we go. 
Ooh, no. And it's like, you can see I'm trying to go all the way up, but it keeps blocking right there. And he's stuck in free fall. Darn it. I'm trying to see if I can grab onto that uh, chandelier and kind of pole vault like the other areas. So if, that, it's that, ugh, if that's the case, I can just skip this whole area and like jump up there. It doesn't look like I can grab onto it. Ooh. That, that ledge is just a little deceptive. There we go. Alright, uh, excuse me, die please. Yeah, now it's like every time I see those things, it's like those have got to be a, a, a secret entrance. Oop. Beep, 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 beep. Okay. I gotta find a door to go through, because... <laughs> is that a rifleman? No, oh, okay. Trying to find, like, a secret door or something. There's probably one down here. Yep. There's, like, a lot of secret areas in, around in here. I just wanted to try and find one just in case something kills me. Because I'd rather not go all the way back. This one took more hits. Ah. I just guessed. Like, I don't know where these secrets are, but I'm like, I wonder if I just hit up, there just happens to be a secret. <laughs> now they're fighting for some reason. <laughs> Oops. Okay, this is the only thing I haven't figured out, is how to grab onto one of these poles um, after jumping off a ledge. Because I can jump on, I can grab onto it like right underneath it, like I just did. Okay, I guess I have to jump into it. No. Wait, I wonder if there's a secret here. No. Okay. Hmm. Okay, just... No. I was like, maybe if I let go of running forward and just keep holding B. Oh well, I guess I'll worry about it whenever I run into one. But it's like, eh, I'm kind of worried if I run into one of these things. And I don't have the practice in. Ugh. Oh well, I'm just gonna go. Why did I fall there? Okay. 
Okay, that's weird. I wouldn't... I think I should stop questioning this game. <laughs> Can't. I guess I can't grab those. Oh shit. Yep, secret. Secrets. Wonder if there's multiple endings, the more secrets you get. So I'm gonna stab them both. Whoa. Ooh, okay. Okay, so all I had to do was hold up and B and just launch me up to there. <laughs> I'll take it. Oh, careful. I don't want to fall back down. Oh, no, 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 no. Fuck. Where is it? Okay. I'm going to set that as my checkpoint. I got, uh, you get hit, um, come on, grab it, the, uh, the yellow guys are, they have rifles, and they can just one-shot you easily, it's kind of pretty lame, still got killed, Bro. What the fuck? That's just stupidly unfair. I mean, it's not hard to get back there, but it's just like, what the fuck? Rubber couch. I think I've already, yeah. Those hearts don't respawn if you get them again. Whoa, why am I facing the wrong direction? <laughs>
Health is getting pretty low. Wonder if I can find a hidden room. So oh, wow. Okay. I didn't think it would be there. I'll fucking take it though. Holy shit. Who would think to think that there was a secret entrance right here? It's so weird. Whoa. <laughs> That's a lot hard, harder than I thought it would, or a lot higher than I thought it would launch me. Arbitrary secret rooms, yeah. And this is where the rifleman was. He's right there. No, jump, jump! Fuck, please don't send me back. Okay, thank you. I think it's complete BS that you can't, like... Oh, I see. Because I jumped on it from a height and landed on the couch, it sent me up a lot hard, higher. Oh, if I can just get past this guy. Thank you. Poke, 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 poke! Die, bitch! Like carefully jumping on this thing. <laughs> yes! Okay. Password! Oh, 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 oh. What the fuck was that? Okay, I'm not going that way. <laughs> I wonder if that's a room over there. No. Alright. Yeah, now it's like, now I'm checking everything that looks like a door. <laughs> I can't tell if I'm hitting him or not. I wonder if it's a bug that he can't shoot it again, but I'll I'll take it. Fuck it. Wait, no, oh, that was close. Looks like I despawned him just enough on the side to where he was able to reload. That would not bad. What? <laughs> Check here. Yep, secret room. Reach the girl. I wonder if there's one right here. Nope. Okay. <laughs> oh, shit. No. Ooh, that doesn't look good. Is this a. Can I vault from here? No. Ooh. Oh no. Okay. Oops. Shit. Okay, let's 
jump back up here, run across this area again, which isn't too bad, it's just annoying that I keep falling. I can't really control him that much either. I think next time I get up there, I'm just going to try and jump over the whole thing without landing on that little pole, if that's possible. Okay. Almost looks like it is. try a couple more times and then I'll try and land on that small one there. Yeah, because it almost looks like I can make it. Whoa, whoa, I made it. Oh, stop. Okay, phew, never mind. <laughs> Secret. No, no, no. Dude, why the fuck would you put him there? Are you serious? Please don't put me there. Okay. I'm really afraid if I get killed by this guy again, I'm gonna start back from the beginning of the area. Okay, fuck you. No, 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 no. Okay. Stop. What the fuck? Man, this game is some bullshit. Alright. Oops, stop. did to hit that. Oh, maybe I have to, like, fall in on top of it or something. Okay, so I, j I literally just fall instead of jumping. Okay, I got it. Hopefully this uses this as a checkpoint. <laughs> oh, shit. Okay, now go up as soon as you get in. Okay, thank God. Fuck you. Are you kidding me? <sighs> he fell through the fucking wall. Because that looks like an area from... Like, one of the prior areas. fall. Yeah, that's... that... 
If it, if I hadn't died and gone back, it like sent me back to the last checkpoint, I would have been fucked. Yeah, Zoro Zoro plays by his own rules, which is fuck you. Okay, jump, jump. Okay, that shouldn't have hit me, but what the fuck ever. <laughs> Okay, let's try this again. Jump, go past, go up. There, all right. Let's try and find the secret. <laughs> yep, sweet. Oh, that's a full health. Actually, looking at it, if this drops and I go down to the um, the little room below me, then maybe I could have, maybe that might have been a shortcut, because that looks like a prior area. I don't know if there's any shortcuts here. I guess I won't know until I go through that door. <laughs> Okay, yeah, so I guess I guess me clipping through the wall would have been a sh an actual shortcut. Still, that's it's kind of bullshit. <laughs> Either way. Secret. I'm just like hitting up everywhere now. Yeah, that was a little shortcut then. Oh god. Thank god he's on the table. Fuck that guy. <laughs> this guy's different. Oh! Okay. The game slowed down just a little bit there. Wonder if I can just jump over him. Hmm. There we go. Whoa. What is he doing? <laughs> uh, well, apparently he vaporized. No, 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 no. Dude, please don't. Oh, wow. Man, that's really frustrating. Like, I'm not even mad, that's just like... Really? Oh, that's interesting, okay. So I think I can catch this guy off guard, like, if I attack after he does his thrust. That's what it looked like. Jump up. Oh, no. So, how did I get through that the first time? Oh, uh, maybe I was jumping. No. Oh, I did it. I'll take it. Fuck it. <laughs> getting stabbed and then bowing. 
Okay, he's on the right, I think, right? Yep. Oh, okay. Um... Is it like a wine cellar? <laughs> Go for the kneecaps. Or the or the beard. Go for the beard. His beard is his weakness. Oh shit. Okay, cool. <laughs> There's a secret there. I'm like, hmm, I wonder if I press up. Looks like I can skip. Uh, wait. Should I be going this way or the opposite direction? No, I can't catch him off guard. Okay. I feel like I'm supposed to go this way. Yeah, okay. Oh, this is a torture chamber. Ugh. Oops. Hmm. Oops. Hmm. How am I supposed to get up there? Oops, sorry. Ow. If I can land on that small platform... I can probably get over there, but... Whoa, what? Like, that was weird. I hit, like, right on the directional pad at, like, the apex of the jump, and he, like, turned, and it almost looked like he gained more height. But the game, like, stuttered just a little bit. Ooh! Yeah, see? Oh, okay. So you don't even need to use the pole, you just jump across it. Oops. Eh. Now he's just falling straight down. Beforehand, he would just kind of like roll. There we go. A little bit. There we go. Why does he just go directly through it? That's so dumb. There we go. <laughs> So what, I have to like roll at a specific, yeah, I just gotta roll at a specific point. I feel like stuff like this is just like a fuck you from the developer. Like, ha ha, this'll get him, ha ha. Like, fuck you. Okay. Ew. 
At least I don't have to like walk all the way back around, go up, and then get here. So what you got going on tonight? Anything fun? Or you just been working on your servers? Accordion games in the 80s? Ah, maybe. I mean, I don't think they had like... Well, yeah, they were all difficult to eat your quarters, but this is like... This is... At least they were functional, right? This is just jank ass bullshit. Whoa, no, I had it. <laughs> I overcompensated. I gotta hit, I gotta hit, uh, right before he lands. Oops, missed that one. Okay, cool. Well, I appreciate you being here, though. <laughs> you could have chosen any streamer on the platform, but you chose me. <laughs> the other side I'm like are you sure you want to watch this <laughs> I've got the volume on this thing turned down pretty low so I'm not getting tired of the music uh, too much but if you want just let me know and I'll I'll turn it down on stream it is it is pretty repetitive damn it timing to just jump onto that ledge from the pole vault. There we go. Probably won't be able to do it again though. <laughs> so those ginger beers, are they um, like local, local brewed? Did it. The game freezes just a, a split second, and I think it's it's because of the um, the enemy that's showing up. Oop. Hold it too long. try them all tonight or just uh, just one at a time damn it well 
I'm gonna take this guy out because I think he's the one that's causing the game to like micro stutter when he comes on screen. Jerk. Three of them into a big glass. <laughs> okay. I wonder if I can jump from to one of these platforms from here. No. Oops. We put more effort into our somersaulting animations than we did into the actual game. decided to try and hit up. <laughs> oh no. Ooh. That was a bad idea actually. Ooh. Mm. Could have put me up there. It'd be funny if I got killed and then, like, got put up there each time. <laughs> Jerk. If I can just jump all the way across without having to try and land on that damn thing. Oh my god, that is so dumb. Oof, I almost didn't catch that. I caught that, apparently. It's like this level's throwing one screw you after another. <sighs> I didn't mean to go in there. 
Because now the rifleman's going to be spawned back in. Yeah. I can't even be mad. Some coffee would make it better, actually. There we go. Shoot. At least I can do it now. <laughs> Whew. Alright, screw that guy. Alright, I'm back here. I can't believe he shot me through the fucking wall like that. Why do you drop? Oh, fuck. Please die, thank you. I just gotta remember that guy's up there. If I ever get up there again, Jesus. Oh, held it too long. Oops.
I should just skip this whole area and just jump right up there. <laughs> okay. Did he already shoot? I'm gonna try and find a secret. Oh man, that was close. Hopefully there's not another one. <laughs> I can't even tell what this guy's health is, jeez. There we go. Trying to find a secret or something. Who's this guy? Nope, pull out your sword, please. I'm assuming this is a boss. <laughs> you know, I sit here and, and find myself wondering, why am I in this building? Like, what's the story? I, whatever. <laughs> why am I here? Pick your pants back up. Sorry, ma'am. <laughs> Can I please finish this level? Like, seriously? Well, there's a secret. Thank you. Looks like you can get through it. get past this guy. I don't even know what his health is at. Fuck off. Oh, there's another one?
I don't, I don't know what to do. I, I don't know what to do. I can't kill him. More than two stories, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, but he just keeps blocking. So it doesn't matter which direction I attack him with. And I can't tell if I'm damaging him because I can't see his health bar. If I block and then attack right after. I, I don't know what to do. Put me back here again. I'm not mad, it's just like I don't feel like wasting my time going back through this entire fucking area. Like, I should have had an end to this this map so far already and, and gotten a password or something. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, I'll, I'll, I'll try and beat the game, but it's just like, this is just... This is just stupid. Hey, if XC has gone. It looks like I was almost done with this area and then I ran into a guy that for whatever reason I couldn't get past him. Like he just literally blocked every attack. Um. And I was trying to figure out a way to beat him, but he just eventually killed me, and then it, it kicked me. The church? Yeah, that was a while ago. I think I cheesed it, though. white and black dude um yeah I I might not have hit that part because I think I I cheesed it 
Oh, the white and black dudes on the roof are hard. You can skip one. Yeah, I, I was able to skip one, but the other one, I, I don't know what to do. And then I figured out you can actually clip through that wall right there and just skip, like, most of this area. Yeah, I tried, but it's just like... I don't know if I'm actually hitting him, because I can't see his health bar. Okay. And it wouldn't be so bad, but it's just like, it keeps... It keeps sending me back to, like, three screens. Ugh. Like, I don't know where this is gonna put me. Okay. <laughs> I mean, so far, I haven't really gotten frustrated or, like, mad or anything about it. This part took me a little bit to, to get to figure out. Oops. <laughs> yeah. And then Campbell was saying something about, um, like, you don't know how many lives you have, but you have a limited number, but I'm not, like, so far I haven't, like, gotten a game over or anything. Unless that's, that is your lives, you, you die so many times and then you're sent back, like, three screens or something. There's been a couple maps where I've been sent pretty far back.
And you can just literally stun lock this guy. <laughs> Come on. Jeez, I don't remember him taking this long to die. Sorry, ma'am. <laughs> I think he has a pistol, to be honest. So maybe that's what he's trying to do, is like pull it out. So I just, I literally just keep attacking him. Okay, it sounds like I'm hitting him. That little burnt. But I don't know if that is or not. Oh, I did it. Okay. Cool. I am Zoro. I'm also Batman. And I look kind of like Bender. <laughs> now I'm afraid to go anywhere because I'm like, I'm going to die somehow and be sent all the way back. It's gonna suck. See this guy right here? Phew, that was close. Need a secret area? Thank you. If, um, if you get a chance... You can watch the VOD and see where I choose the, uh, the church area. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. Okay. Ah, oh, crap. But it's at, at the far end, um... Like, after the podiums, there's a second confession box. And then to the right of that is, like, a little ledge with... It looks like a, a screen or something with a purple guy with a rifle. And I, I waited till he fired, got on, the, got on that ledge, and then just, like, kept jumping. And I'm not sure if you're, you're not supposed to go through that, that area or not, but that's how I got through. Because the door was literally, like, right there. Yeah, so I don't know if it was... If I clipped through it. Um, or if that was, like... If I was supposed to go through there. <laughs> oh my god, dude. When does this level end? Seriously, because if I die, I'm probably going to be sent all the way back again. Is that another white and black dude? Nah, that's a rifleman. Shit. I can just jump over him. Ha, ah, fuck you. <laughs> there's a secret there. What? That was a secret. Oh, but there's nothing in it? Whoa. I think I just skipped part of this area. Uh-oh. Okay, thank god. I thought it was stuck. <laughs> um, kind of. Yeah, I mean, there's like... There's... 
there's like spots all throughout each level you just hit up and it's like even even on a wall and you could find a, a secret secret room or whatever um can I not oh see just like right there that was a secret area it didn't even look like a door Uh, this, yeah, this whole game's a secret. Go for the kneecaps. Too much credit secrets, yeah. <laughs> oh, here's the door. Holy shit, thank you. This is way, way too long of a level. See, you found ten secrets. Are you all right? Do you have the map? Do you have the map? Find it. Is your army ready to fight Santa on us? No, sir. Then why are you asking me if I'm all right? Of course I'm not all right. Who's talking? I've never seen this movie. <laughs> Oh. Whole new area. Secrets. This is an interesting color palette. This guy's gonna die? On this level? This is... I think this is the last level, right? What the fuck? Did you see that? Okay, what the fuck? There we go. Jeez. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, it's not awful. <laughs> Secret. Oops, shit. I ain't gonna bother fighting him. Oh crap. I guess I don't have a choice now. Oh, never mind. <laughs> Ow. Ow. Dude, what the fuck? I thought you could jump on those yellow pipes. Oh, okay, that's my fault. Oh, there's a, a rope right there, okay. Just kind of blends in with the fucking background. Shoot at me? No? Okay. Damn it. <laughs> oh, alright. Well, that's a weird place to put me. Yeah, it's a little bright. Especially in here. Here we Ugh. 
Man. <laughs> Whoa. That launched me up pretty far. Oh my god, stop. <laughs> I absolutely love to hate it. Ugh. Yeah, that's pretty much an acid trip. So, look at the purples. Can I just jump up here? Like, just on that? No? Okay. Whee! Thank you. Now fuck you. <laughs> Just skip him. Stop freaking out. <laughs> I think I, I did get a clip of him, uh, he like fell through, fell through the floor and then like immediately clipped through the ceiling and he's like, oh, thank you Jesus, <laughs> or save me Jesus. Oh shit. <clears throat> Yeah, I know. Okay, this guy won't die. Oh shit, he just teleported and I forgot he can shoot you. Wow, this is what I this is what I mean. So this must be me running out of lives or something like that. Because I don't understand why I got sent back all of a sudden. Yeah, that's why I haven't been, like, doing the, the game redeems. Because, like, I think, I think we all, like, ate them up pretty fast. <laughs> there was a, um, a site he mentioned a while back. Uh, where you can get, like, cheap, uh, cheap games on Steam, but, um, it's legitimate, but I forgot where it was. What the fuck? There. <laughs> I can't say because I've never played any of those games. Um, I don't... I don't think it's like, um... Was it that Honey Cam Studio or whatever it is? It's like a... A Candy Crush clone or something? I think they're all just, like, graphic novels. Oh shit, I forgot you, they can't... I they shoot you. Loves in the air bundle? It's not? It's out there. <sighs> yeah, the honey pop one, that's what I was talking about. Oh, you're right, this is different. I can't stop yawning. <sighs> Excuse me. 
eight games for 12. Didn't, didn't he already pay when the pass was around? Oh, I guess it doesn't matter since he'd be giving it away. They look pretty cool, actually. Uh, this a story beside. Looks like an RPG Maker game, but it looks neat. Well, uh, well, hang on. There's this, the Black History Month bundle. Mafia Three: Shadow Man Remastered, Shaq Fu Remastered, Giant Silent Bob. So they're like semblance. I might, I might be able to pick that up for him. I'll save that. <laughs> yeah, the Simi Sakura special. It's like nineteen games for twelve bucks. I mean that would that would fill it up pretty quick, but I I don't know if anyone would actually grab those. <laughs> Yeah, he did play it um, when the patch was around. That was a point and click. But he actually played through it. Yeah, that might be a good bundle to, to get him. I might I might pick it up for him or something. Watch, I, I'll, I'll buy him and give him the keys, and then I'll proceed to win all the giveaways, and then, <laughs> and then I'll win all the games. It's like, oh hey, I just, I just bought all these. <laughs> Forgetting that I'm supposed to jump. <laughs> well, at least it's like the first area, so it doesn't really matter, I guess. You said you said you were <clears throat> stuck at the uh, at the church. Is that so? Were you playing that on stream, or were you just kind of just playing it offline? I mean, it's not even that late. I just can't stop yawning. 
I'm playing offline, okay. Do you have the cartridge, or were you playing on like a little emulator? Yeah, to be honest, I think your best bet is through the Mister. Um, also, because um, the Game Boy Player on the with the Retro Tink is added with uh, if you're playing on like a modern TV. It's probably gonna add add some latency to it. Probably not too much, but with a game like this, you probably kind of need as little latency as possible. Also, the only thing about this is um, I got all the the core set up on the pocket, and uh, that's what I'm playing on right now. Um, I can remap the buttons, which is cool. Uh, I don't know why the rumble strength, but there's no display mode settings, so I can't go in and and change. Um, change the display like I could if I was running it from a cartridge um, so I can't give it like a certain look um, not that it needs to really be changed but it's like that's the only caveat with using the cores Okay, this is weird. I've never had them do that before. Don't the snack adapters like add a little bit of latency at all? Okay. 
Yeah, because so far I've been using the um, APIDO controllers, but wired, directly wired through USB. Whoa. That was a secret. <laughs> Is it really? Oh, that's right. No, it's not. It's like a utility USB port or something like that. I feel kind of bad. I mean, I spent all that money, like, actually buying the Mister and spent the time to set it up and all that stuff, and I haven't, I have not touched it. Yeah, user I.O., yeah. Like, don't get me wrong, I'm, I'm, whoops, shit. <laughs> I'm glad I picked one up when I did, because it's, like, impossible to get one now. But, um... I just haven't... I just haven't touched it. So. Well, that's good. Oops. Yeah, I know you were playing the, um, is it X68000 or something like that? Yep. How did that kill me? Which, funny enough, we just got a uh, PC Engine CD core um, not too long ago. I've got it installed, um, but I don't. It's it's not there yet. But I mean, I'm, I don't think I'm really going to use my pocket to play PC Engine CD games. I'm still. Um, <laughs> Touch it with my wow stick. Excuse me, sir, please die. Ouch. Yeah, I think I ran into that same issue too when I was setting up my, um, the tear onion thing. To let go of it. I jumped into that shot. Oh, let's fight this guy again. Oh, I still think right now it's like the Mister is just the best option that you can get visually. Because, I mean, I can... You can hook it up your console to a retro tank and send that through a capture card and stuff like that, and it still won't look as good. Damn it. 
Cool. Yeah. Whoa, hey. What? <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> oh my god, it's my first raid. Hey, Jenna. Hey, Ben. How's it going? Thanks very much for uh, stopping in. Thanks for the raid. Raid with 12 and 1 of 4. Very nice. Thank you. Uh, I am Delicious Gavi. Um, currently, right now, I have accepted a challenge from Pale Blue Camel to... Uh, be man enough to finish this game, which is the Mask of Zorro on the Game Boy Color. And it's very jank, very, very broken, and uh, it's sometimes not the greatest experience. <laughs> Just like this guy. Yes, everything is on the line. <laughs> Oh, my alert's not showing up. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah, I, um... Jen, I did, uh... I started a couple months ago, maybe a little bit further, but it was just off and on. But now I just kind of wanted to pick it up a little bit more. And I got the uh, analog pocket. So it's really, really nice system. I love it all. Um, and I just installed all the cores that came with it. Um, yeah, for some reason my alerts are off screen. Hang on one second. What's that? Sorry, hang on. <laughs> Unfortunately, I can't figure out why, why that's not working, so... Oh yeah, yep, I've got a mister as well. Yeah, he uh, he kind of got me with that, or Camel did with the, um, was it VIP, then Catwoman, and Powerpuff Girls, but I don't really feel like going through the Powerpuff Girls. Oop. Okay. Ugh. Oh really? That's cool. Yeah, I I am really impressed with with a lot of stuff people are doing with uh, FPGA. It's really impressive, especially this. I mean, <laughs> mm. man, this is so tough. Was this rope always here? There's a rope here, but I can't climb it. Was that always there? This is what I'm talking about, how broken this game is. Ugh. 
Yeah, it's just, it's not supposed to be there. Ugh. Oh wow, my screen's breaking. It looks like it stopped. Maybe that was just... I'll have to check the VOD. Maybe it was just on my screen. Did you? That's really cool. Oh, so you guys did... You did see the rope on there? Okay, because I think it was just like some screen tearing or something. That was really bizarre. Oh, crap. Let's see if I can land this. Nope. <laughs> Alright. I feel like it won't matter anyways, because if I do end up getting over there, I'll probably just be killed. <laughs> oh, cool. <laughs> but yeah, again, uh, yeah, my name is Just Licious Coffee, and um, I wish I would I wish I was playing a better game for everybody <laughs> to view. Because <laughs> this is pretty bad. And I just fell through the whole thing again. I mean, you can tell by his jumps just how bad this is. At least the music isn't too bad. Yeah, it's like sometimes when he when you eh, and you get also get one shot. Oh wow, okay. Uh, this is what I'm talking about. Cause like you could be anywhere like further, almost probably to the end of the level, and it could be random after you get killed, you get sent all the way back to the beginning of the map. Which is what this is right now. Yeah, there's a lot of games I probably, like this for example, I probably wouldn't play on my own. I don't have patience for it. But, uh, I, I heated the, uh, I heated the call, the challenge. <laughs> yeah, I, I, um, I gotta figure out if I want to play the PC Engine on the core, on the pocket, or... Um, if I want to use my actual PC engine, because I picked one up a long time ago. I'm just going to see if we can skip this guy. Oh yeah, uh, I don't know, I'm sorry, I didn't think of this till just now. I don't know if I have... I don't know if I have, if I have shout out set up. No, okay. 
Um, Fexi, I, know, I think you know Ben. Um, Jen is one of Ben's friends, um, and she also streams. Give her, give her a look if you get a chance. Shout out slash command. Okay. Is it, uh, let's see here. Oh, there we go. Okay, cool. Oh, okay. I have to wait two minutes to get another shout out. <laughs> oh, okay. I'm assuming if I do it, set it up through like Streamlabs or something like that, there's no queue. Okay. Yeah, and I'm sorry, my um, alerts aren't working. Uh, I did have a, a Windows update and it broke all my audio and it looks like it broke my follow alert so thanks for uh the follow jenna and thanks for the follow uh capital lamia hope i said that right <laughs> and then let me um let me try another shout out Nine seconds. <laughs> hmm. The only reason I'm not currently playing at the moment because I'm like I just need a break from it just for just like two minutes because it's starting to wear on my sanity. There we go. So yeah, thank you guys for the raid. Appreciate it. Yeah, I'll look at the. I'll, I'll need. To, I, I want to add like um, sound effects, command sounds, stuff like that, um, and a couple other things. And I guess the shout out thing I need to set up as well. Yeah, actually, that's a good idea. <laughs> um, let's see here. Yeah, actually, I would like to take a break from this game, um, even though I'm at the. Looks like I'm at the end. Um, but yeah, it's starting to wear on me a little bit. Uh, is there anything specific you want to see? Um, I've already got my Game Boy cores all set up and organized. Uh, I've got organized <clears throat> separated between JP and, and English. I've got Game Boy Advance set up. Uh, I picked up some hacks, some homebrews, uh, translations for the GBA. Um, I was playing around with SNES. It works. It actually works pretty well, to be honest. I was surprised. Um, but I've got um, in the uh, Parodius. Um, oops. Yeah, let me see here. Just the regular Game Boy. Hmm. Maybe it's maybe I got under JP. Uh, 
And here's the Japanese version. Oh, it didn't play it? Wait. Uh, hang on. I'll try this again. Where is the... Okay, that's weird. Hang on, let me... Oh, my games are gone. This was working earlier. <laughs> Maybe I should, uh... Let me restart this thing here real fast. Yeah, it is a little bit. Okay, it should be booting up here. Yep, here we go. That's the cartridge. Okay, this is weird. Let me try the advanced. Okay. Let's see how this looks real fast. Human soft. Yes, we are. Okay, so that seems the Game Boy Advance core seems to work fine. And we know the Game Boy Color works okay. Uh, let me see if there's a Proteus game on the Game Boy Color. Iridian 2. <laughs> uh, what's that on? Oh, GBA? Okay. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'll have to look look into why my the Game Boy Core or the ROMs aren't working on that one. Iridium too? Okay. Majesco? Okay. Is it? Alright. Sure it's better than Mask of Zorro. <laughs> This part works pretty decent. Wow. Oh, that's cool. You can set the the bass, the chords, the lead, the drums. Ace pilot. Let's try a starter. Oh, did you play this game? Oh, I can't do an arcade mode. More than a hundred years have passed since Earth. Oh, sorry. There's voices. <laughs>
until now. The last Iridian is in captivity. The galaxy has at peace. Until now. Metro Fusion? Yeah. I, I definitely want to play Metro Fusion. I've got, uh... I think I've got my cartridge still in. Still have my original Metroid Fusion box. Hopefully the game's still in there. <laughs> Cartridge alone right now is going for like over a hundred bucks, I think. It's kind of stupid. But I definitely want to play this and uh, the other Metroid game on the GBA. Yeah. Um, what's the other one? Metroid um, Zero Mission, which is like, what, a remake of the first? Of the first Metroid game on the NES. Um, I've got that too sitting around somewhere. Loads of fake, yeah. Uh, there's loads of fake um, Metroid Fusions, uh, Zelda the Minish Cap, Pokemon, especially Pokemon. So. Yeah, I, I actually haven't played it. I've played Zero Mission uh, back when it came out, but um, I ended up like trading it in a GameStop for like pennies compared to what it was supposed to be. Um, but at the time, you know, still, still kind of new since it wasn't considered retro. So, but I did, I did manage to get another copy back. You need someone to defeat them once and for all. I was told you were the best. Complete the virtual reality training program to prove that you know how to handle your Shun Fighter. If you already know the drill, press B to skip VR training. Oh, okay. I was hoping it was this. I've seen... I've seen videos of this. And I'm like, I definitely want to play this game. Big Pokemon games are everywhere. Yep. I, I went to... Um, There's a place I used to work at. Uh, and literally, right next door through the wall was was a uh, a little used game shop. And I went in, and the first game I saw there was um, Pokemon Emerald. And I'm like, yeah, I'll buy that because it was like it was like 15 bucks at the time. It was ridiculous. And um, got home, popped it in, and I got this message saying, um, what "Was it's like." the game can be loaded now, or something like that. You first turn it on, and it's like, the game can now be loaded. I'm like, this doesn't seem right. So I looked online a little bit, and I'm like, this is a bootleg. Uh, so I took it back to the guy, I'm like, hey, you know, even though this, you're not supposed to sell this, this is, this is a bootleg. And he's like, oh, I'm sorry. Let me call another shop. And they had, they had someone drive down from another shop uh, in the area and hand me an actual cartridge of Emerald. So I was like, I was really happy about that. So, um, well, if there's there is a battery in there, and it's supposed to be used for um, the day and night cycle, so if the battery's dead, um, you know, it'll say, yeah, it'll say something like the battery. Well, I mean, I'm sure you already know that. But I was I was kind of bummed out because I didn't even know about fake uh, GBA games at the time. Your spacecraft is capable of auto firing by holding down A. If you double tap and then hold A, you can release a powerful beam. Okay. Pew, 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 pew. 
Wait, what? Okay, so I tap it. Oh, wow, okay. To upgrade your weapon systems, you need to collect power-ups. Power-ups are carried by special enemies. The enemies must be destroyed before they'll drop power-ups. Oh, uh, okay. Okay. Yeah, mine Mine was, um, that must be a different fake for fake cartridge then, because the one I had, like, said the game can now be loaded as soon as you actually turned on the, turned on the system. After collecting power-ups, press B to upgrade your current weapon. After you upgrade... After you upgraded a weapon, your spacecraft will be extended by two satellites. The satellites can be moved up and down when releasing A by holding A. The satellite's position is fixed. Oh, okay. Lock satellites to their current position. Press select again to unlock them. Okay. Uh, what was it? B? Wait. Oh, okay. Oh, did you? <laughs> People are actually buying the repos, repros now. Like they're they're kind of like small commodities. After collecting a power up and before pressing B, you also have the choice to change to a different weapon. Press LR to select your desired weapon. Each weapon can be upgraded three times. You can change two already upgraded weapons at any time. Pressing R, L, and R. Now collect as many power-ups as possible. Night. And experiment with different weapons. What's repro? Oh. Um, I've actually got a couple repros. Yeah, there's um, actually a couple places on eBay. You look around and they'll make, um, they'll take fan translator ROMs and place them in, um, in like aftermarket shells and circuit boards. So I picked this one up. This is um, Magical Vacation, which is a Japanese only game, but it got a fan translation. So somebody like made a physical cartridge of it. Sorry, you can't see it too well. Um, I need to get a, a different layout so you can see the camera a little bit better. But that's the GBA one. Um, yeah, bootlegs and three pros. Let's see here. This is a. Super Mario Land 2, six golden coins that has a, that's made for the GB, the Game Boy Color, and it actually has a color palette uh, made for it. It's actually pretty cool. Um, I can actually play that next if you want to take a look at it. So I got a couple of them. They're actually pretty neat. Um, there's only a couple games I actually picked out for it. Um, there's that Pokemon Nuclear, I think that's what it was called. Or it might have been, like, Crisis or something. It's somewhere back there, but um, I picked up a physical copy of it. Yeah, I can pop that one in next. The original color palette? Okay. Well, for the six golden coins? Because I thought it only had, like, a... A regular limited color palette um, for regular Game Boy games. Oops! Oh, oop. wasn't paying attention. So oh, there we go. Oh, okay. So you can up, you can upgrade and then swap between the weapons. Oh, 
Oh, that's cool. Yeah. Whenever you start any level, you're equipped with one smart bomb. Smart bombs are also occasionally floating around and waiting to be collected. Collect a smart bomb. To release smart bomb, press R and L simultaneously, okay? Whoa! Wow! Still can't get the the charge shot figured out. This is the end of the VR training. Good luck on your mission. Good luck. Great. Now that you are familiar with the controls of your ship, head to the Alpha Galaxy. Once arrived, select any of the three planets. I will contact you again after defeating the Iridian forces on all three planets. Looks like a nice shield or something. Okay, so you get choice auto upgrades? Oh, okay. I'll just start with the basic. Oh, that's cool. I like this. Oops. Ah. This is really cool. Let me guess I can't blow those up. Turn down the, the sound effects just a little bit so I can hear the music more. Snake, are you mid boss? Whoa. <laughs> Wait, I didn't get damaged. Whoa. I got damaged that time. Okay, we got another checkpoint. I have two smart bombs, but I don't think I need to use them anytime soon. <laughs> That's cool. Oops. <laughs> Ouch. So little spider guys don't shoot anything, they just kind of jump out in front of you. Like they're pretty generous with the checkpoints. I'm assuming the um, harder difficulties don't 
really have as many. Whoa, what just happened? Uh, I think the game just froze. This is normal. <laughs> Yeah, I think it froze. Yeah. Mm, shoot. Oh well. I definitely want to play that mail. I'll, I might play the first one. Um, actually, first before I play uh, this one. <laughs> If I run into that issue again when I play it, um, I've got uh, a GBA EverDrive. So that might uh, have a little bit better stability. But yeah, it's a little disappointing. Have you played the first one? Okay, I'll just go ahead and up in the Mario Golden Six Golden Coins. Oh, it just it booted right up. Huh. I haven't seen this yet actually. Actually looks pretty nice. God, I haven't played this game in forever. This is actually it's a little nostalgic, because <laughs> I remember actually getting this game uh, on my Game Boy, like originally. It's nuts. It, I, this looks pretty cool, I like this, but I agree, it's like, I still like the, the way the original would look. Wait, swap out the... Luigi? Game detail tools. This was another cool thing about the pocket. Oh, I can't select the display. Oh, that's right, because it's running off of a game. It's technically a Game Boy Color. Um, I do have, I think it's Solaris. It's got the uh, Solar Striker. See that. 
This is actually one of the, I, th I think this might have been the first um, shmup on the on the regular Game Boy. That was the first time I've seen that. It's kind of neat, actually. This is where um, the the pocket is has some visual aspects that are actually pretty cool. So if we go into video, I can select display mode, and right now I'm on the regular analog uh, visual, but I can swap over to the original DMG look, which is kind of neat. It also mimics a little bit of like the after the shadow after effect. Um, I can also change it to more of a Game Boy Pocket look. Um, there's the Game Boy Light, which is a, uh, like a Japanese-only pocket that had a backlight to it, like a blue uh, backlight, and then they added a pinball matrix look to it, which I don't think I could play it like that for very long. But I like the, um, I kind of like the look of this. It looks pretty clean. Yeah, the Game Boy Light's the, uh, busy pocket. I, yeah, I've actually got one. <laughs> that was like my holy grail of, uh, Game Boys to get, and I managed to get one uh, at a pretty good price. And I couldn't couldn't pass it up. Uh, scan lines on this, yeah. yeah. Oh, I'm gonna die. Hang on, there we go. <laughs> Don't want to come back and die. You talking about the? Oh, you mean scan lines on the on. Uh, the analog GB? Um, unfortunately, no. Oh, the Game Boy Mini. Um, which one's the Game Boy Mini? Hang on. You talking about the micro? Uh, hang on. I might have that as well. Uh, the micro is not the same as many. Oh, okay. Well, I've got a micro. <laughs> it's kind of junk, though. It still works fine, but I kind of cheaped out on it at the time. I was like, well, it's 40 bucks is a little much for a micro, but now it's like 120 bucks. <laughs> um, what's the Game Boy Mini? I don't think I've ever heard of that. Hmm. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Was it, um... Yeah, I'm not sure. I I don't think I've ever heard of the Game Boy Mini. The only thing I'm seeing so far is, uh... Um... When I look for a Mini, it either comes up as the Micro, or it'll pop... It, it came up as, a Like a Chinese knockoff or something like that. Oh! Uh, oh, hang on. <laughs> ah! Hang on. I did see my alerts pop up. They were just on the, the left-hand side of the screen. Oh, Italian Grandma. 
Uh, thank you for the raid. Thanks very much. White whale. <laughs> uh, everybody stopping in. Thanks for uh, thanks for the raid. Uh, my name is Delicious Coffee. Um, I've been playing kind of on a Game Boy kick for a little bit. I'm uh, using the Analog Pocket, which is an FPGA system, and I've got some cores installed on it. Um, but I actually am using the uh, my original cartridge for this, so. Yeah, I I think I got pretty far when I first originally got this. I can't remember how far, but I never did actually beat it. Oh, the Game Boy Light, yeah. Okay, sorry. But not the dock, yeah. I'd, I'd really recommend getting a dock if you can. Um, that's what I'm using right now. It's it's definitely a, a game changer. Um, I've been trying to beat the... Yeah, I... Uh, uh, accepted a challenge from Pale Blue Camel to see if I can beat it. I've gotten pretty far. I think, I think I'm on the last stage, but it it's it's so broken. It's really jank. So um, I'm taking a break from it right now. Which probably is a good idea because it's starting to wear wear my brain a little bit. Yeah, it's uh, it's it's on the Game Boy Color, um, and it's based on the movie. Um, but it's very, very broken, um, and it's not it it's not a hard game. But because it's so broken, it kind of adds this like layer of artificial difficulty, and it's just like it's not something you want to experience. <laughs> Sure. Yeah. No problem. Thanks for uh, thanks for raiding in. If I don't see you again. Yeah. You too. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. Oh, and thanks for the fall as well. <laughs> Actually, uh, depending on how far I get in this, I want to check out. Uh, I threw on Star Fox, and I want to want to check out how it runs on the SNES Core. I think it's got a, an FX Turbo mode, which would be pretty pretty neat, actually. So. Oh wait, forgot about that. Should probably give. Italian grandma shout out. <laughs> there we go. Um, you know what? I don't know. I'd have to look. Um but so far it's run run most of the games that I've chucked at it. Um but I I'm interested in, in seeing if it it actually might. I know the I know the the um Mr. does now. Uh, it'd be cool to have uh, is it that special arrangement music for Link to the Past. Yeah, I just gave him a follow. Whoops. <laughs> yeah, I'll have to check out their stream sometime. I have not played 
this game in a long, 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 long time. I actually picked this up at um, Stone Age Gamer, which is... Uh, I don't know if you've ever heard of them. They actually... Well, they're, they actually sell um, the Everdrives and everything like that. But their store is actually here in, in Ohio. They're actually about 45 minutes away from me. Uh, and they actually have a physical storefront. And I went up there with a couple friends. And I just went to town on all the Game Boy games that they had. So. Did you? Okay. Yeah, they're really cool people. Um, you need to return it. Right, I forgot there's no continues. So once you die, it's game over. <laughs> to your return policy on Deluxe Everdrives? Okay. Can't get it to work. Um, before you have to return it, send, uh, send an email to support. Um, it might be, it might be the, um, SD card that you're using. Um, no, I've, I haven't added them to it yet. I just I have, just have a couple games on there. Um, the, I want, actually, yeah, I want to check out the um, Star Fox. Oops. This looks really nice. I'm not sure that's translating on, on the stream, but this looks really cool. <laughs> um, let me bring up the menu here. Core settings. Servo. Super FX Turbo. The Fireman? Okay. I don't think I've heard of that. Super FX Turbo, but maybe I need CPU Turbo as well. Let's turn that off and just try it anyway. The base. Slow down. I don't. I can't remember if there's any at the very beginning there. Holy shit! Holy crap! This is like a completely different game. Whoa! Yep. <laughs> can't react fast enough because without the slowdown. <laughs> Ouch! I almost need to turn on, like, turn the slowdown on. Jeez. Wow. The 
this is crazy. Like, I know there's a, um, like an actual ROM hack that you can use on the EverDrive. Uh, it's like, it's basically this, it's a speed hack. Or effects check for speed hack, then I slow down. Well, actually, I don't know if you can use it on the EverDrive. I know you can use it on the regular emulator. Uh, but I've never actually played it myself until now. I wonder if I can change the core in, like, real time. Yep. Holy shit. <laughs> Look at the difference! Oh. You, you didn't see that. No. I don't know what the CPU turbo is for, though. See if I can enlarge it a little bit. Yeah, right. <laughs> Can't enlarge it too much. Before they had the charge shot kids. A, uh, a KB Toys in the mall uh, where I used to live, and they had a promotion going on. If you got, um, they had like a little kiosk up front at the entrance to the store uh, where they're selling it. Um, you got to play it, and if you, it was you can only play the first level. You can only do it once per person. Uh, but if you got like a certain score. They give you a free t-shirt. And if you got, like, the top score, um, I think you won some kind of giveaway or something like that. But, uh, I didn't even make it to the... I didn't even get a score to get a t-shirt. <laughs> Though at how fast this runs.
Let's start out. What was that called again? Super Apex Turbo. What was that? What was that? I didn't see that. <laughs> I'm updating the uh, stream title. <laughs> um, I don't think so. No. Um, it's you just pull it directly from an SD card, micro SD card. Andros's forces intend to build a base in this area. Destroy their rock crusher. Good luck. Here you go. Uh, no. I don't believe so. No, it's all, uh... The only way you can update it or put anything on it is through a micro SD card. Which, I mean, that, that works pretty well. I don't... I haven't seen a need to actually connect it to a Wi-Fi or anything. GTA 5? Like he was streaming GTA 5 to the to the Game Boy. <laughs> I forget the channel name, it was like should should it should this be or something like that, I can't remember. Yeah, they captured the church too, yeah. Oh. Can't really 
notice how far they got down on their shields. <laughs> Yeah, it's so nice to be playing games again. <laughs> See what is what was that? The Andros Space Armada. The Space Armada consists of powerful battleships. Destroy their energy cores. Good luck. Freaking love the soundtrack on this game. Oh yeah, okay. some blasters. Asking you shall receive. Ouch. Oh, actually. Ship down. I guess not. I'm not the best. Uh, I'm not the best at Star Fox. Did I really miss that? <sighs> that sucks. This is actually kind of hard. <laughs> Okay. 
Is this where we fly around in the core? Yep. Okay, I remember this. Drained, like after I get home from work. Uh, especially after drive home, it's it usually sucks to do that. I'll come home and then I'll like I'll just turn on a stream or YouTube or something like that. Um, but ever since I like started streaming just semi regularly, um, I'm actually excited to actually start playing games again. It's, it's kind of nice. Battle base meteor. Be sure to use your retros if you're going too fast. Be careful with my R wings. What do you mean your R wings? Good luck. Well, oh, I don't remember this area. Whoop. I remember the music, but I don't remember the ceremony. Ouch, ouch. Okay. Okay. Shit, what the fuck? Oh, this is like at night or something, is that why it's hard to see anything? <laughs> Shields, thank you. Yeah, like, it, like especially. Oh no, is that a full game over? Do I get to continue? Okay, I only get one. <laughs> Damn. Um, but yeah, it's like, even at like I got the pocket. Um, so when did I get that? I think it was like October, November, I think. 
I hadn't even touched it, to be honest. Yeah, it does look a little smug, don't you? <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. Um, but yeah, it's like, if I wasn't streaming, I don't think I'd, I'd ever play VIP or, or, uh, Catwoman or anything like that, because I, I probably wouldn't have the patience for it, um, but I actually had fun playing them. Whoop. Whoop. I don't think you can deflect shots in this game. I think that's only Star Fox 64. Yeah. Flying helicopters in space. Ouch. 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 Oh my god. Um multiple endings? No, I don't think so. You can see the different paths, but I don't I don't think there's one or anything like that. Hang on. Oh, hello. Hmm. I don't know if you can see her or not. <laughs> I know I have a uh, a cat in my lap. Ugh, cat breath. Um I would reach up and grab the camera, but yeah. <laughs> It's a little eh, too far away. Yeah. I actually didn't mean to save you there, Slippy. Whoa, whoa. I am not <laughs> doing well, fuck. <laughs> You can actually see pictures of her put up on the on the Discord. I missed that shield. No. I'm not dying in here. Slow down. Slow down. Too many guys. Get off my screen, Slippy. I thought it was a train. <laughs> Give me that shoe. Oh my god. <laughs> was that my last life? Okay, this is my last life, and I don't have any continues. <laughs> it looks like I got a checkpoint. I'm not sure if this is a checkpoint or not. That's a game over. <laughs> now I gotta start from the beginning again. Oh, cartridge. Oh, that's where I can swap between.
Actually, I have Super Mario All Stars, but it's not the uh, doesn't have the Super Mario word world to it. Looks pretty nice, actually. Uh, is there anything you recommend or you want to see? Get uh, Kid Icarus. No. What's this? Um, just a couple. Uh, Link to the Past, Mega Man X, Secret of Mana, plus a uh, ROM hack, Star Fox, Super Mario, All Stars, and Super Mario Kart. <laughs> I just threw on some basic, uh, some of my favorite basic games on there, just to test them out. But I might actually throw on uh, a bunch more, a bunch more at some point. I don't think I have. I don't think no. I don't have any. I wonder if there's a Proteus game on here. There's Pocket Fighter. This is the uh, Wonder Swan co uh, core. Okay, there's. Hang on, actually. Yeah, speaking of Wonder Swan, uh, let me look up real fast what the. Uh, Is there any shmups on it? Run dim, return to earth. There it is. Oh, is it not loading? Fuck. I did test out Final Fantasy 1 and it worked. There we go. That was weird. I don't understand why that wouldn't run beforehand. <laughs> Judgment Silver Sword? Hmm. I'll check to see if I have that after this. Run him. And the, um, the cat breath. What is on the hook? Color is um, pretty much, all, I would think, on par with the Game Boy Advance. Can't really skip any of this. Oh, it's a. What, just, what did I just do? No. Oh, two. <laughs> Maybe not. This kind of looks like a flash game, actually. <laughs> uh, the slowdown is real. So I hit the special button again.
This is Judgment Silver Sword. Is it on the one or one or the one stone color? Oops. Ugh, I can hold down select and it increases the speed. It must be like a small CPU overclock. On the color, okay. This is uh, a little janky here. Ouch, 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 cat. Oh, thank you. I'm currently being cleaned. I don't know if you can hear her. <laughs> yeah, she's <sure>, sheepy. <laughs> Is it? Yeah, I assume all the games for the Wonder Swan currently are, are pretty expensive. Um, I do have one in the box somewhere. Uh, back when I had a lot of disposable income, I tried to collect as many, as many uh, systems and handhelds as I could. Was it judgment? There uh, we go. So we got two of them. Rebirth edition. Oh, these are two different revisions. Ooh. Oh. Oh, thank you. This looks cool. Uh, what button am I supposed to be pressing here? start easy first. Ooh. What's that? Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Ooh, this is cool. I like this. This is on the handheld. Whoa, okay. What is this? I just immediately go into the next stage. It's a shield, kind of. Whoop. How much? It must have been... God. Oh, hi. Where are you pointing that? Oh, yeah, one hit death. I know each each system has their own like 
holy grails and stuff like that, but... I don't know, some of the prices are just absolutely fucking bonkers. Ooh. That's cool. I can kind of slow them down, but not by much. <laughs> This seems pretty cool. I like this so far, but not for thirteen hundred dollars. Ouch. I notice that sometimes too, it's like games that are that release near the end of the system's life cycle. Uh, they only get so many releases, so there's only so many out there. There's no break in the battle. Charting, jeez. Darn, just hoping I could squeeze through that. say this though, it's like with Everdrives and even the Pocket, I mean it's already, I mean if you're, if you're going by what the game's priced are right now at, and, I mean Pocket's already paid for itself. I mean I like having physical media. Um, whoop. I can't guess. Turn on my shield for that one. No. Is that completely over? <sighs> Are there any others? <laughs> you see? Okay. I can't pause it. The game is so hard, you can't pause it. <laughs> okay. Gundam operation.
Oh, yeah. Night, Ben. Thanks for stopping in. Thanks very much for the raid. Appreciate it. Hmm. Katie appreciates it too. <laughs> I don't know if you can see her or not. It's a little bit. Okay, I'm not sure what I'm selecting here. Yeah, you too. Thing. Ouch. Oh, is this a uh, rhythm game? Well, you can see. Uh, I have no rhythm. <laughs> hmm. do anything. <laughs> oh, it's just to kick it if I was jumping over it. Oops. Yeah, it does look pretty cool. Uh... I completely screwed up the beginning part because I thought I was supposed to jump over it, not kick it. Oh, he'd probably love it. <laughs> Oops. No? Okay, I'm not getting this. I thought it would, yeah, I don't know. I don't know if I'm supposed to jump over it or kick it. But the only option is to... Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I can't get it. find something else. Oh yes, I'm, I'm sure he'll rage quite hard at this. Um, let's see here. Oh, SD Gundams. Maybe I can search for that instead. <laughs> there we go. Was it... Was it generation or operation? Hang on. Operation, okay. Side pocket. <laughs> that was a clock tower game in here. Excuse me. Well, that rhyme writer is like sixty five. shooter
Oh, whoop. Shoot or beat him up, okay. Seems pretty cool so far. Ah. Oh, can I turn around? Oh, okay. Fired. What just happened? What's going on? Why is space white? Oh, how did I do that? I like the uh, the idea behind this. How do I use my beam sword? So if I'm close enough, I can get like a little combo of sword attack in here. Oh, but he's got an axe. Well, ow! What did I just do? Okay, I guess we're descending to the planet. <laughs> Very sorry. Thanks for the follow, Retro Gaming Backlog, if you're still there. Oh, okay, so we got like a little bit of a ground mission. Can I jump? No? Okay. Looks like it stopped time, but everybody's still moving. <laughs> Ouch. Oh, I can't get close enough. There we go. Sweet home for Halloween. Oh, that's cool. Okay. the same red guy? I haven't seen him blow up yet. 
Oh, well, he's dead now. Or, he was. <laughs> so playing through a bunch of Zellas? Okay, that's cool. style of, the, of these guys. It's kind of a neat little spin on, on the shooter genre. Something a little different. It's kind of neat. In between you got these little cutscenes. Some kind of war zone. Oop. Ouch. Are you shooting bricks at me? Blocking, but I guess not. Look out! <laughs> and everyone's dead, including me. The end. <laughs> Somehow we survive. That's it for me for the night. I forget. I'm not sure when I started streaming. But, uh, yeah. Um, I will catch you later. Um, I'll probably try and stream tomorrow night as well. Um, depending on what I got going on. Um, I'm trying to get, I'll try to get some of the Game Boy Colors, uh, Game Boy Core setup. I'm not sure why I wasn't playing those earlier. Um, I'll do some research. Maybe I'll try and beat Zoro. But um, until then, thanks for stopping in. Thanks for watching. 
and thanks for all the raids and the follows. So uh, we'll see you guys later. Have a good night. Oh, wait. Yes, raid. Sorry, I just thought of that. Uh, who do we want to raid? <laughs> um, let me open this up real fast. Thunderfoot Bros. Okay. Cracked him. Give me one <sighs> second. So tough to navigate this. Hang on. Okay. So they're playing Mega Man Rock and Roll. Okay. Alrighty. Well, alright. Thanks again. And uh, we'll see you guys later. Have a good night.